Lawyers. Most people's perception of them is what they've seen on shows like Law and & Order. And that's not to say that if you need a lawyer, you're a criminal, because there are all different kinds of law. You've got corporate law, family law, international law, and, of course, criminal law. Now, all of this is pretty complicated, so to help us make sense of it all, we're catching up with a real-life lawyer. You must be Jessie. You must be Abigail. I've got a couple questions about being a lawyer. Could you help me out? Sure thing. Come with me. OK, Jessie, what would you like to know? Well, I just want to know what it's like to be a lawyer. Being a lawyer is obviously a very broad field. There's all different types of law. I specialise in criminal defence law. My job is to represent people in court on a daily basis when they've been charged with a criminal or traffic offence. And so what does your day look like? One day I could get up and drive into the office and then spend the day in the magistrate's court or the district court or the supreme court. Every day is different, so the variety keeps, keeps things exciting. A lot of people have seen criminal law on TV shows like Law and & Order. Is it like that at all? I'd say no. Um, our system is very different than the American system, but also it's very dramatised and also it's a, a lot rougher than you'd expect. And so why did you choose criminal law? I've just always had a, an interest in criminal law. But when I started my law degree, it became apparent very quickly that I wasn't really interested in the more commercial side of things. It's always been the criminal side of matters that I've been interested in, and I've always gone down that path since. So is there much demand out there for lawyers? Yes, which some might say, unfortunately, given that I'm a criminal defence lawyer, but at the present time, there's a great need for criminal lawyers. There's um, a lot of demand. So what's the best part of the job? The best part of the job is having a grateful client at the end, the effort you've put in, the, the work you've undertaken, um, and it's, it's those clients that make the whole job worthwhile. What's the hardest part of the job? I think the hardest part of the job is dealing with families, those, especially those who've been convicted of a serious offence and their, their loved one then gets sentenced to a, a period of imprisonment. Obviously seeing anyone you know go to jail is going to be quite a traumatic experience. And so if I wanted to become a lawyer, what's one piece of advice you would give me? You need to be dedicated to your studies not getting distracted by the glamorisation that a lot of the TV shows and such like put on criminal law. What characteristics does someone need to be a lawyer? To be a lawyer, you need to be determined. You need to be thick-skinned. It's fair to say that over the years I've become quite cynical about a lot of my work. I'm a lot less trusting than I used to be. And so from school to today, what does someone need to do to get to where you are? Well, one needs to study law firstly at university. Um, you need to obtain your law degree. It's very rewarding, but it is a hard slog in the interim. There's a number of years of study and then further training afterwards yeah. before you're a fully-fledged lawyer that can really go out on their own. Yeah. And uh, if you could end up where you are, but do one thing differently, what would that be? Well, at the present time, I'm a sole practitioner. I run my own business. But from a business side of things, I'm a little lost in that <laughs> I didn't undertake accounting, I didn't undertake any business studies at university, so I'd probably have looked at perhaps doing a business unit back at university just to give me that breadth in the business world. Well, I know lawyers charge by the minute, so I think it's probably costing me a bit much, so I think I'll let you get back to work now. <laughs> Accounts in the mail, Jesse. <laughs> so there you have it. If you're determined and hardworking, maybe you've got what it takes to be a lawyer. For more, hit up myfuture.edu.au.